welcome to Sunday quiz number nine. And this one comes to you courtesy of a little bit of a hangover. Celebrating um, Arsenal within the FA Cup for the 14th time. Sorry. Yeah, well, I'm not sorry, actually. Not at all. I'm quite happy. <laughs> I'm the opposite of sorry. About... Anyway, on with the quiz. That's what you're here for. So, again. Okay, uh, same format as the previous uh, three or four quizzes. Um, score speed this time is 16, not 13. We're up from 13 to 16, so this one's obviously a lot easier. So, good luck with that. And on we go. Okay, uh, name the film from the still. That hair, I could probably carry off that hairstyle soon. Well, oh, that's question one. Two, name the film. Tough one to start off with. Yeah. Question three. Uh, four. Four is obviously, I'm going to spin through these too quickly. And five. And six. And I think the last one on this little batch is this one. Probably the most tricky of the seven. Right, change of tack from Green seals to that's the movie from the emojis. Not tack from the movie. This one. Allow me a little bit of artistic license with this one. When you get it, you'll know what I mean. And this one. I'm afraid. And I think the last one on this section. Okay. Now, the hardest section. Unscramble this little lot. Now, as of last week, number of words in the anagram are not necessarily the same as the number of words in the actual film title. But you have got the year the film was published. So help do so. Pause, put the kettle on, get your tea coffee, go through it. There's no hurry. Okay, and last section then, can you identify the following films from their posters without the text? So, what's this film from 2014? And what's this film from 1993? This one from 2006. And the last one is probably the trickiest of this section from 2014, not a film I've actually seen. Not that that helped you. And if I was doing this group, I wouldn't get this. But I'm not. And that's the 20 questions. Right, so 16 to beat. Pause. Okay, name this film. 101 Dalmatians. Corella de Vier. This one, tough one. The Flintstones. Three. Brave Heart, of course. Mel Gibson. And that's Eddie Murphy, I believe. And the Nutty Professor. And this one, classic, speak this in Seattle. Meg Ryan and Tom Hanks. And number six, Jim Carrey in The Truman Show. Not a fan of Jim Carrey, but this film's a very interesting film concept. And it's the hardest one you've got to do. Um, Kevin Costner and Whitney Houston in The Bodyguard. Did watch the film. Thought it was a pile of pants. Right. Okay, guess the movie from the emojis. We've got a princess and we've got a frog. Tough one. Ah, we've got the Earth, which of course is a planet. And then we've got the monkeys. Planet of the Apes. I told you a little bit of artistic life. Thank you so much. Uh, um, BT. BT phone time. No, I don't. And. Got a notebook in the middle, which is all you need really to score the notebook. And this lot, right, how do you get on? Well, it's difficult this time. The first two, I think the third and the fifth one, um, cause problems in this household. First one, 1972, The Godfather. Second one, in 2008, The Dark Knight. Third one, Schindler's List. Fourth one, Pulp Fiction I've done before, different anagrams. 
and Risk Hat for Oldest Era, 1981, Raiders of the Lost Ark. So well done if you got those five. In the last section, on the 17th, can you identify the final version of the buzzer's mind is protect? So the imitation game. What's his name? Can't remember. <laughs> Top of my head. Um, from 1993, free release. Uh, the clue is where the picture is set. Dino Royale, Daniel Craig, um, Benedict Cumberbatch. Tim, got it. Great. And the last one, 2014, uh, Jake Gyllenhaal, or Jake Gyllenhaal, I don't know how to pronounce his surname, but it's from the film Nightcrawler, which I have not seen. Thriller, but it's good. Might watch it. Right, brilliant. There's your 20. Um, hope you did well. And um, yeah, we'll see you next week where I won't rub it in to the non Arsenal sport. Bye. Now.